think? Well, it's interesting, you know, looking at the the lack of airplanes taking off. And when I do see one, I think I'm glad I'm two miles offshore as opposed to being in that airplane cramped up. Oh, there's one coming up now. But That's how I act over there. They're supposed to, they're usually about three minutes apart, and it's certainly significantly longer than that at this time. May, March 28th, <laughs> Saturday, March 28th. And of course, Santa Monica Pier is completely deserted. There's no colors. I didn't even recognize it. Well, one thing for sure, the water is the same. But when you looked at Santa Monica Pier, I didn't know what you meant when you said, uh, is that Santa Monica Pier? And, and uh, then I recognized that all the lights are turned off on the Ferris wheel. And it just looks like an average pile of uh, machinery on the shoreline far away. Weird. Weird. I do think that we could invite people to go sailing. You and I are six feet apart right now. Aren't we? And besides, do husband and wife have to be six feet apart? I don't know whether we should invite people on board. What is your opinion on that? The CDC says no. <laughs> the CDC cares about sailboats. <laughs> I'm extrapolating. I'm extrapolating from the CDC. Well, I, I, I think we could, we could have at least four people for dinner, couldn't we? <laughs> on the boat? Yeah. No. Well. First, you'd have to touch their food, touch their silverware. They wouldn't want to eat your food. Well, we touch our silverware. Yes, but that's us touching our silverware, not them touching our silverware. They don't want to touch our silverware. What if we all wore nitrile gloves? Possibly. Possibly. I think there's plenty of room, although you may have a point. <laughs> well, I think you do have a point. Let's see. Four people. So once it's there, once it's there, once it's there, once it's there, and on a 38 foot boat there, they're about three feet apart. Anthony Fauci says no. I know you, you're in love with Anthony Fauci. Everyone's in love with Anthony Fauci. What's not to love? Yeah, well who was that other guy you were in love with a couple months ago? <laughs> He's in prison now. <laughs> what do you call him, all you ladies? Oh, Hottie Avenatti. Hottie Avenatti. Hottie yeah. Avenatti, yeah, well. Uh, yeah. That was a joke, though. I truly love Dr. Fauci. Well, I wasn't first in my class at Cornell Medical School like he was. I tell you that sailing is sailing, whether you're self-isolated or not. But I, I have a concern. I didn't get an answer to this question of our, our married couples expected to stay six feet apart? No. <laughs> oh, what a relief that is. I want to see what the dolphins are doing. See the dolphins, please. Do oh, there was one. There. Oh, no, that was just a bird. Dive. So the dolphins have self-isolated? No. <laughs> that boat looks very alone though out there. You know, you're right, there hasn't been a plane taken off from Los Angeles International Airport in, in 10 minutes. How many of your uh, business colleagues have had to lay off people? There's a lot. 
things not to be spoken of today for a few hours at least. I think you're right about that. But you know, it hasn't kept the sailing community. Maybe one of the only things you can do is go sailing with your spouse. But there are no ports on which to land. You have to keep going back to your home port. Yeah, well, the fact is, I seriously considered uh, sailing to Hawaii this summer until, I don't think I told you that, until two weeks ago I realized that the harbors in uh, on Kauai and all the islands are just as closed as they are here. And uh, there's a lot of paperwork involved in getting a slip in Hawaii, so even that guy shot to hell. Well. 2020 was supposed to be the year of perfect vision. I don't know about the year of perfect vision. I'm looking forward to looking in the rearview mirror in about six months.